Hi, I'm Dr. Greg Stern, Stern Chiropractic, helping your kids maximize their performance in sports, school, activities, and life. Why am I here in my tie-dye today? Well, besides it being a beautiful 90-degree day in Chicago, I'm here to talk about something that people associate with tie-dye and, ooh, kind of out there. I'm here to talk about meditation. And the thing to understand is this is an incredible tool to help you center and enhance your focus and performance. Now, last month, I filmed a video on deep breathing, and it's somewhat a prerequisite in order to meditate. So I encourage you to go to the website, www.sternchiro.com, go to the newsletter tab, and look up deep breathing in the search box. It's a short, easy exercise on how to get started deep breathing right now. You'll find that once you start deep breathing, the way I'm teaching you, you will be able to totally relax and de-stress so simply and quickly you'll never want to stop. But today, we're here to talk about meditation, and I'm going to show you an easy way to get started right now so you and your kids can learn how to center yourself, focus, relax, and improve your performance. So let's get started. All right, here we are. In order to get started meditating, one of the first things you need to do is have your environment prepared and ready for you to get started. What do you need to do? Well, find a place that's nice and quiet. I've left the lights on here so you can see me, but try to find a place where you can dim the lights so it's nice and dark and comfortable. It doesn't have to be pitch black, but bright light certainly isn't the best thing. Also, remove the distractors. Leave your cell phone out of the room, turn off the phones, get rid of the distractors. You're here to be with you and nobody else. Now, positions. You want to make sure you're in a position that you can be comfortable for the period of time you're going to meditate. Initially, you may only meditate for a couple of minutes, maybe five minutes. Maybe you'll work up to 15, 20, or 30 minutes. I personally try to meditate about 15 minutes a day. The research shows that your brain waves are most receptive to meditating immediately after waking up or right when you're about to go to bed. So those are some of the best times to meditate. I personally like to sit on my heels when I meditate, but sitting here in a cross-legged position is another wonderful way to sit. Or if sitting like this is uncomfortable, sit in a chair, it's okay. You wanna be upright with good posture. In addition, you wanna to try to raise your butt a little higher than your knees, so I encourage you to have a little cushion to sit on when you meditate. Now you can be nice and comfortable and ready to go. There's something called mudras or hand positions. The hand open is sharing the energy with the world around you. Hands down is kind of containing the energy to yourself. Some people like to connect their first finger and thumb. It's a traditional way to meditate and circulate energy. It's not important. The important thing is that you get in a comfortable position and you get started. After you start to experiment, you can do whatever you want. Look into it deeper. There's lots of different types of meditation. It's all good. Just get started. Again, I mentioned the video on deep breathing. You want to review that first so that you know how to breathe in through the nose, down to the belly, and back out through the nose, a deep, comfortable breath. One of the misnomers about meditation is that your head has to be clear, and if it's not, you're not doing it right. Guess what? Clearing the head, having no thoughts, is certainly the goal, but even those of us who have been doing it for well over 20 years, we ain't there yet. So when thoughts come into your head, just let them flow out. 
Focus on the breathing. Focus on the sound of the breath. Let your body relax and as thoughts come in, try not to focus on them. Just let them go. When you catch yourself focusing on them, then you realize that and then you let them go. Again, just close the eyes, sit up nice and tall, relax and breathe deeply. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, meditation is a wonderful tool to help you relax, help you perform at your maximum, and help you to get the best enjoyment out of life. Now next month, I've got an incredible video on how to enhance your performance through visualization. Make sure to tune in, make sure to use the links below for the previous newsletters I've written on meditation so you can get a whole lot more details than I was able to present today and have an absolutely incredible day. Peace.